What is going on guys? Dustin here with another NASCAR diecast review. Today we are taking a look at our second AJ Allmendinger diecast review. And this is actually a very, very special one indeed because not only is it autographed, this is also autographed edition. You can tell by this certificate right here. It's also one of the first few Darlington Raceway throwbacks. Back to the 2017. Now, you're possibly wondering, now if you're a Terry Labonte fan, you should recognize this scheme because this is the scheme that won his 1984 NASCAR Cup Series Championship. This is actually the Piedmont Airlines colors. Of course, the blue can be a little bit lighter, but that's what this appears on the uh, on this right instead. Enough about Terry Labonte, which is, you know, Texas Terry, he's a really cool driver. I'll admit that. Now, throwback weekend, it's always been one of the most enjoyable weekends of all time. You know, the nostalgia of seeing these schemes hit the track again. Like, let's say, uh, Chase Elliott doing his uh, original throwback to his dad's Coors Light car from 2015. To Kyle Busch's various... Eminem's throwback schemes, and just recently he did a throwback to Elliot Sadler when he was racing the 38 for machine. So, so quick question: What's everybody's favorite throwback? You can always comment down below. What's your favorite? There are a lot, but those are the only ones I can remember. I do have a few Jimmy Johnson ones myself. I actually do have the. Uh, one from 2015 up on my wall. But I don't think I have any of a Chase Side up here besides his uh, 2015 ride. Which is a throwback. <laughs> but I like to see Chase Side do a throwback to his uh, first x championship car. So that's going to be a really awesome one. So anyway, enough about that. Let's take a look at this. Today we're taking a look at our second AJ Allmendinger car. Now, some of y'all like the uh, Bush Baked Bees color chrome car which is actually you know really amazing you know it's just that color that just amazingly pops out and just really attracts your eye unfortunately this one's not color chrome but that's okay anyway this is the uh the almondinger that kroger quick click list from chevrolet ss and this is actually the autograph version which is really awesome this uh, so it's just, oh my god, this thing just really is amazing. Here's the up front. You got Chevrolet SS. You got JTT Daughtry Racing. You got number 47. Up on the hood, you got Kroger Clicklist. And there it is up on the windshield. The real, authentic autograph of AJ Allmendinger. That is 100% real right there. There is no and zips or butts about it. You also got the Monster Energy banner up here. You also got the number 47 in the same style as Terry Labonte's number 44 1984 championships here. Champion car. Up on the sides you got, got Mog Mahal. Now these are actually some of the now what really makes it interesting about Throwback Weekend is even the uh, contingency sponsors are even in their throwback modes. You got Mog, Mahal, that th middle one, I don't know who that one is. Ed Elbrox, Sunoco, and instead of the yellow lettering for Goodyear on the tires, they're actually white for a change. I think uh, just recently they did, did it with the uh, blue line, and that was just really amazing. And here we are, we got NASCAR International. That's the uh, NASCAR her throwback. There we go. Got Monster Energy. Oh, you got Texas Stands on here. Now, I don't know what that one is all about. It's been a while. Of course, I'm reviewing a 2017 car in 2020, so that's amazing. Got Mechanics Wear, their old lettering, 3M, Mobile One, Sherwin-Williams, Flowmaster, some of these are just incredible throwbacks, which is really amazing. Now, 
Imagine seeing those today. The silver bullet, of course, which is a Coors Light. Up here, you got, oh, we got Miller, we got Sullivan, Paltec Air Compressors, Freightliner, SEM, Sherwin Williams. Down here, you got hmm, Zag, RE, Wix Filters, Kroger Click List, Briar's Ice Cream. I'm in a mood for ice cream, by the way. Kingsford, Scott, Bush's Best, Velveeta, Crisco, American Ethanol. Also, you got click list on the uh, back. Now, unfortunately, the roof flaps do not open, which is a bummer, but that's okay. Now, if the hood just op hood opens, that's all I'm ha that's all I'm happy with. You got the uh, unique diecast identification number. Here's some of the uh, much more smaller, smaller sponsors that are on the uh, on the deck lid of this car. Now, I don't want to re. Now, I'm not going to read off of them, but if you want to pause here and read them off, off that is fine. Alright, we can go back through review. Up on the back, we got Click List, SS, in the whole. We got seven Kroger logos on here. Now, let me take it in the light. Yeah, there's seven. Also got AJ Allmendinger's name in just basic lettering, which is really amazing. Anyway, let's take a look at the underside, which is a molded chassis. Now, this is kind of ironic considering the fact that later on, 2018's, 2018 and on diecast cars would feature this very same right here. Oops. Uh Hope I didn't damage it in any shape, way, or form. Just an accidental rollover, just like his uh, Talladega wreck. Y'all remember when uh, AJ Allmendinger gave Chase Elliott too much of a tap, and they both went into the wall with Chase Elliott right up off the wall, and then you got Allmendinger just riding on his side until just slowly rolling over. And you got Mike Joy saying, well, AJ, that was a humdinger. <laughs> Alright, I hope I didn't hurt the car too much. And we're going to poke this precision screwdriver in. Pop open the hood. That basically gave us some uh, access. And here is the engine compartment. All we got is a Chevrolet bow tie, and there is the engine itself. Now, let me actually uh, take this flashlight off. Off from the top real quick and uh, excuse me real quick. There we go. Not bad for a light wand. Which is really amazing. And remember, you can always get yourself self one of these from Harbor Freight. They are very, very affordable. Of course, this is not a uh, Add for a Harbor Freight tool. This is a diecast review, but that the link for this slide is down in the description below if you want one. So, and there we go. Oops, <laughs> did a burnout up on the uh, this special autograph edition certificate. So, anyway, I hope y'all like this video. Leave a comment, subscribe for more NASCAR diecast reviews. This is possibly now my, uh, well, third consecutive day in releasing these videos. So, anyway, my name is Dustin, and I will see you guys in another video.